Marshall football fans were treated to quite a nail-biter here at the Jones C. Edwards Stadium tonight as Marshall beats Memphis 17-16. to Darius Marshall scored in the first minute of play, but momentum was slowed as play after play was reversed due to little mistakes, including Darius Marshall's own second touchdown run with five minutes left in the half. Turns out that he did step out of bounds. Needless to say, Herd fans were a little bit upset. Now, a field goal pushed the Herd to a 10-3 uh, lead over the Tigers at halftime. The Tigers' Arkeelan Hall threw a great game, including a third-quarter pass to Maurice Jones, who dropped the sure touchdown. An 18-yard touchdown pass to Darius Passmore left fans on edge as the refs insisted on taking a second look, but they did eventually confirm the touchdown, as Passmore did have one foot in bounds. With 8.14 left in the fourth, Memphis kicked a field goal, bringing the score to 17-16, but the Herd defense held strong through the final second of the game, leaving Marshall on top. Crowd favorite Cody Slate was still out of the game tonight, but Coach Snyder says to expect to see him back at next week's game against Southern Mississippi. Coach Snyder had this to say about the team's win tonight against Memphis. We played a very good Memphis team. We played very, very hard and gave us their best shot. They gave us everything they had, and uh, I'm proud of our guys. You know, I, um, unlike last week, I think we uh, handled the adversity a lot better. Last week, we didn't handle adversity very well. Uh, they went back up on us, and our young people finally, we took another step tonight because we was able to handle that adversity and come back and take the lead again and uh, hold on to a win. So from the Jones C. Edwards Stadium, I'm Henry Heisey, Palester.net. The College Network.